<coughs> uh, this is the device that we developed. We call this the Easy Outlet. Um, it has an outlet and uh, network connection, uh, network card. Uh, what this device allows the user to do is uh, to control the power on or off uh, using an uh, uh, Apple uh, app. Um, to start this device, just uh, plug the network connection. And this goes to the router. Uh, the router is connected to the internet now. And uh, connect the power. Um, the yellow LED will indicate uh, <coughs> if the unit is connected to uh, our server or not. So if the LED is uh, the yellow LED is uh, on, that means it has connected to our server already. And to control this, the user will uh, download our app. Uh, you will need to start the app. The app will connect to our server as well. And once it's connected, uh, the user will need to add this device to the uh, the, app, the Easy Outlet app. To do this, press on edit, there's a plus button, edit, you ask uh, for uh, the device ID, every device that we have has a unique ID, um, it's written at the back, in this case this unit is ST8GA, so let's type ST8 And before uh, adding it, um, you must uh, press this button to put the unit in add mode. So once I press this button, so the lights are blinking, showing that it is, it is in add mode. And now I can add. So the unit is successfully added and the LED light has stopped blinking. So now we can control this unit. Uh, using the app. So to turn it on or off. So to turn off, the light has gone off. And to turn it on again, can also reset. Okay. Other than this, um, you can check network information. Uh, you can give it a host name. It will tell you the WAN IP, the LAN IP. User can uh, do some other settings. Uh, for instance, um, set it to uh, auto reset mode, <coughs> um, which means that uh, it will check the internet connection. So if this unit has a uh, if the router has lost its internet connection, uh, the outlet will automatically power cycle. If it's set to manual power, it doesn't do, it doesn't do the power cycle. Uh, the ping after um, this tells it to ping do the ping one once it goes online. Um, Ten minutes, thirty minutes, or sixty minutes after it has gone online. Outlet status. This just tells you the current outlet status. Schedules, um, you can set different schedules for it to turn on or off. Time, this is just the current time. Information, and this is information about the model and the version, the firmware version in the unit. Okay.